Hi everyone, today we are going to discuss the topic is permission set group. Please stay healthy, stay safe. Please go through WHO website for latest information on COVID-19 outbreak. Let's see what we are going to discuss. As part of this session, we are going to discuss what is permission set group and how can we create a permission set group. So what is permission set group? It's a set of permission sets. What is permission set? Basically, permission set is a set of permissions which will be helpful to extend the permissions of user without touching his profile. This will be useful. Okay, if you don't know permission set, please go through other sessions available in our uh, administration playlist for uh, profiles and permission sets. Then you can get to know what is what it is. Okay, now as part of this session, we are going to see what is permission set, how we can create the same. So permission set group is a set of permission sets and when we need it, whenever you want to add multiple permission sets to a particular user, instead of uh, assigning a different uh, permission sets, you can group into a permission set group and you can assign the single permission set group to user. Then he can have permissions of multiple permission sets with the help of permission set group. This will be the uses of this permission set group. Now, let's see. See here, as I told you, we can combine the permission sets into one meaningful permission set group. And you can assign it, or you can assign the permission set group to the different users, not profiles, okay? Now, see here, without permission set group, if you have permission set one, permission set two, permission set three, you have to assign everything individually to the user. If you have permission set group, this is how it looks like. You just need to combine permission set one and permission set two and permission set three to a permission set group. Then you just need to assign a permission set group to user. Then he automatically access the permissions of whatever you included in permission set group, whether uh, a part of permission set one, part of permission set two, part of permission set three. Okay, so where we can create? When you go to the setup, then you can just you just need to search for permission set groups or permissions or in quick find. Then you can see this permission set group option. There you can do that. Now let's create three permission sets or two permission sets, and then we can create a permission set group, and you can assign it to a particular user. Let's see how we can do. I already opened a setup. Just to open setup if you want again. Just need to use permission sets. First of all, I am creating a permission sets. Now, I am going to create permission set here. I will create contact permission set. Save. Here, I'm taking object settings just for this example. And here in contact, I'm giving all permissions. Simply. Now I'm going to create another permission set. So click on new. I'm creating case permission set.
okay now I'm giving all permissions here also till now case permissions and one more permission set you can create something else anything lead permission set lead permissions so i'm just creating permissions only till now so as you know you can create any kind of permissions here apps permissions connected apps and object settings and everything here now again i am going to give permissions for the lead okay let's see just give permissions so here what we are doing we are just creating multiple permission sets nothing else and uh, you don't need to worry about it now we are going to learn how you can combine these permission sets by using permission set groups so if you see here permission set groups is also there when you are trying to search with permissions so here good so just need to click on permission set groups under users menu under setup Now click on new permission set group and uh, I will give case lead and opportunity. What else? Contact group. That's it. Simple. I have created permission set group successfully. Now I have to assign permission sets, right? So if you see here, permission sets in group, okay? Click on this. Add permission sets. Click on add permission sets. And what, what we have? Contact permission set case permissions and lead permissions simply now you have assigned three permissions to a permission set group that means you combine the per three permission sets to a single permission set group okay now you have permissions or permission sets one two three three permission set groups are there you just need to go to this permission set now so what we did, we have created permission sets and then we have combined these permission sets to a permission set group that is case lead contact permission set group. And now this next step is if you want to assign this permission set group to user, you just need to click on manage assignments. Click on manage assignments. Click on add assignments. And whoever the user you want to, you can assign. For example, you can assign this here, assign. Okay, simply permission uh, set group was not assigned to user. See the messages below. Okay, the user licenses doesn't allow. Okay, because of can't assign permission set. Okay, Salesforce tech two. Yeah, cool. Let's assign it to our user another user tech book yes see permission set has been assigned to one user if you go to this user salesforce tech book user you can see this see permissions group set assignments 
you can assign this from edit assignments also okay this is how you can work with permission set group so again what is permission set group so permission set group is a set of permission sets and you can combine it will be helpful to combine different permission sets into a single unit and you can assign this permission set group to user instead of assigning multiple permission sets individually that means whenever you need to assign different kind of permission sets to a particular user instead of assigning different permission sets to the particular user you can assign permission set group by combining those permission sets okay please go through this reference link i'll give this reference link um in the description of this video also you can go through that it is in trial head also you can have a look into it please subscribe to salesforce tech book all the best